Hey everyone, okay, so today I'm gonna to be giving you my thoughts, I know I'm late to the game, on Jones Road. And I'm gonna be talking specifically about these products here, which are the Miracle Balm. So let me show you the colors I got. So I got the blusher here in Miami Beach. I got the blusher in Flushed, which is this color here. So let me show you, there's Miami here, and that's Flushed. I also got Au Naturel, which is this one. And I also got Magic Hour, which is this one here. I'll talk about that one in a second. So let's apply it. I've already applied these before, so I already know what they're gonna look like, um, but you don't on me. So let's apply Flushed. So with these, you have to break the seal, as I'm sure you know, because they are a, it's a very kind of emollient product to say the least. So I'm going to get some product on my fingers and I'm just going to kind of just do this. And now I'm going to pat it onto the high points of my cheeks, which is generally where I prefer to have color. And of course a touch into the temple area. I might just add a touch more. It's a very, very emollient product. I'm going to just, whatever's left, I'm just going to take across the bridge of my nose, rub it in, and then just really work it into the skin. Because if you just leave it on top, there is a lot of shine to this. So there you go. So you can see some color there. I'm also going to take the Au Naturel and I'm just going to take a little bit of this, just a wee bit, and I'm just going to kind of rub it into my palms. And then I'm just going to very lightly, just here on the sides of my forehead, just to kind of complete that and give it a bit more luster. So, what do I think? Firstly, you get a lot of product here. You get 50 grams of product. It is huge. And a little does go a very long way. My hands are very sticky. I actually think while we're talking, I'm gonna take a little bit of, that's actually not a little bit. I'm gonna take a little bit of the Miami Beach as well. And just really, really slap my face with this. And then I'm gonna just really pat it to work it in so that I've got that flush without there being too much emolliency on the skin, too much of that wax. It's such a pretty, pretty, pretty color. I'm gonna take some on the bridge of the nose and down it as well. Finish off just above the brow. Okay, look at that, all done. I mean, it's a really pretty product. 50 grams is huge amount of product. It will last you a long time. Now, for those of you with a very oily skin like myself, it may not be the product you reach for the most on a daily basis because of the oiliness of your skin and the oiliness or the nature of this product. However, I really, really like it. Those of you with very dry skin will love this, love it. Now the Eau Naturel contains no color, just that emolliency, that wax. Magic Hour is a totally different ball game. It is filled, filled to the brim with shimmer. I'm just gonna, you're not gonna see this, so I don't know why I'm bothering, but I'm just gonna rub that on the back of my hand and then show you in the camera. Let's see. You don't know if you're, it wants to fill my face because it's so pretty. I don't know if you can see that, but it is filled to the brim with shimmer. Now, totally unusable on me because I don't wanna walk around like that, 
but the most beautiful highlighter. For those of you who love a highlighter, it is so beautiful. Now I've just rubbed this off on the back of my hand, um, on the back of a towel. Oh, come on. And you're not gonna see maybe, but it is filled with particles of shimmer. Almost like a glitter, but a very fine glitter. It's so pretty. I wasn't entirely sure how I was gonna feel about these, but I feel very, very good about these. I think these are so, so pretty. I probably think they were more pretty if I could actually see. Hold on, I've just had a shower. One sec. Let's get my glasses. That's better. They're beautiful. They're really beautiful. Here's a little question for you, which I've been pondering myself. So I actually have the Jones Road um, bronzers and they're stunning. They're absolutely beautiful. Great on the skin, great as eyeshadows. They're beautiful. Other than pretty much that, the entire range, 90% of the range, is full of shine and shimmer. Now, if anybody remembers Bobbi Brown back in the day, particularly in the very beginning of her career and her, and her books, it was all matte. Everything was matte. She was very much about matte makeup, matte blushes, matte eyeshadows, the obviously matte bronze, all of that stuff. Now, obviously her line changed over time when she sold it and she certainly had made it quite clear that she wasn't particularly overjoyed with the way that the brand had gone with her name. But this range is her, but it is now packed full of shimmer. And it just find, I realized that perhaps her taste just changed as she got older. Um, but I do find it, it's quite a paradox when she was so against all the shine and shimmer and now her entire line almost is full of it. I've never met Bobby Brown. I hear that she has a very, very good sense of humor, a very fun, naughty, dark sense of humor. That's what I've been told. I don't know if that's true, but she sounds like my kind of girl. I love these. I love these. Miami Beach just to reiterate, is this one. And I did buy these, by the way. I bought them from Liberty in London. Um, and that's flushed. They're just really pretty. I think that looks really lovely. I really do. Very, very, very impressed with these. There you go. That's my thoughts. The ramblings of a 45-year-old man. See you next time. Bye-bye.